All right, well, we're all excited about the total solar eclipse that's going to happen on August 21st, and a lot of people have the eclipse glasses, but maybe you want to watch the eclipse through a pinhole projection camera. So that's what we're going to make today. It's very easy to make. A lot of us have all this stuff in our house anyway, so I just wanted to go over all the things that you're going to need. Uh, first thing you need is a cardboard box. Uh, the longer, the better, because the longer the box is, um, the larger the projection image is going to be uh, of the sun that you'll be looking at. You need a white piece of paper for your screen. You need some scotch tape. You need some duct tape because who doesn't ever want duct tape around? Uh, you need some aluminum foil, and that's just what you'd have in your kitchen. The uh, sturdier baking uh, aluminum foil is going to be your better bet, but anything that's aluminum is good. And then you need a little pin or a needle, and you need a pair of scissors. So what we're going to do, what I've already done ahead of time, is I've cut two holes in the side of the box. The first hole is the viewfinder. That's what you're going to look through. The second hole is what we're going to cover with aluminum foil because the only light we want getting into this box is going to come from the little pin. And what we're going to do is we're going to take some of this duct tape because we want to make absolutely sure that we're looking at uh, not letting any light into that box. So what I'm going to do is tape that over it like that. You just want to make sure it's secure and that there's no light sneaking in around the edges of that aluminum foil. So that's very important. Okay, so we'll get this. Again, it doesn't have to be perfect, it just needs to, needs to serve the purpose. Okay. All right, so we've got that fixed up. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put the sheet of paper on the far side of the box, okay? Because you're looking through, it's almost like you're in a movie theater. So you want, this is going to be your movie screen. And that's going to go right there. All right, so the next thing you want to do, when you close this sucker up, you only want the light from that pinhole going in, and of course you're gonna be looking through this. So this is your viewfinder, and you wanna keep that kind of small just so extra light doesn't, doesn't go in there and contaminate everything. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the duct tape again because it's opaque, <coughs> and we're gonna seal the box up. And we're just gonna to try to make this dark box. It's almost like your own movie theater. Okay. I get this sealed like that. Okay, and then you got this part here, light can still get in there. So you want to seal it up really well. All right, so now, looking in there, it is totally dark. There's no light coming in from this, okay? So now I've got to create my pinhole. So I'm gonna use this thumbtack that I've got, and you want the hole to be uniform, so you know, don't, don't let it slip or anything, and just poke a little hole in there. That's all you need. It can be a needle or a little thumbtack, and you just poke the hole, just like that. It's real small, it's supposed to be small, because what you're gonna do is you're gonna be letting light from the sun go into that hole and it's gonna be focused onto your movie screen, that white sheet of paper that we have taped on the inside of this box. And so during the eclipse, what you'll do is you'll look through the box until you can see the sun. It's just gonna be a dot and it will show up on the inside of this box on that white paper and you will actually be able to watch the eclipse take place. You'll be able to watch that whole thing through your very own projection pinhole camera. Hope you enjoyed the video and uh, look for more Eclipse videos on WSPA.com.